So last week, we completed our first cycle of seven topics on attitude, competence, and execution. And all of this can be found on our website in the media section. Now, this week, we're kicking off our next cycle of attitude, competence, and execution topics. And this week, we're starting with stop letting your people whine. So we all know that sales is a tough business. I mean, there's so much out of our control. You know, there are things that we want to happen that get delayed or never end up happening, or you know, the things that we don't want to happen that end up happening. And this makes for a, a very frustrating experience as a salesperson. It's easy to see why some salespeople drop into complaining, whining, moaning, blaming, you know, and, and that, that, that's okay as long as it's not more than about five minutes, because anything longer than that is just self-indulgence. And it really ends in blame shifting and dodging responsibility. So salespeople may not control a lot, but they can influence things. As long as they bounce back from their setbacks quickly by restoring a possibility mindset, learning how to control what you can control is a big step in a salesperson's development. So this week's topic will give you some ideas of how to get your people to stop whining and to start controlling what they can control. 